Well, despite delays due to snow, the city of Flagstaff is still operating. And Kimberly Ott talked with, with reporter Michaela Clark earlier today about tomorrow's city council meeting. Take a look. I'm Michaela Clark here in the studio with Kimberly Ott with the city of Flagstaff. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me here. So it's a big snow day today. Boy, it was. It was interesting. We were expecting even a little bit more according to the weather service, but thankfully it wasn't. Um, it caused the city to, to uh, start with a two hour delayed schedule. Just again, trying to get folks in safely. Uh, a lot of it had rained the night before and we had that thunder snow. And so there was a little bit of dusting of ice on the bottom, made it a little slick, but everyone got it in safely. The things I wanted to emphasize um, to your viewers about snow is um, now that most of the storm has passed, this is when we rely on our residents and businesses to help do their part, and that's to clear sidewalks in front of your home, in front of your business. It's required by a rule in the city of Flagstaff. We'll actually clean it up for you and charge you for it if you don't do it yourself. Uh, but it just helps people safely, especially children on their way to school, uh, make sure they're getting to and from school safely, and also the businesses in the community. The other thing I want to mention is fire hydrants. We've had so much snow that in some areas and neighborhoods of Flagstaff, they're kind of buried. And so if you can help unbury a fire hydrant, that would be important to protect your home and your business. Um, and if you're a contractor clearing snow, make sure you don't plow those fire hydrants in. So just come supple safety tips and, and we can all have fun in the snow together. And so there's a Flagstaff City Council meeting coming up? Yeah, so this is a regular meeting. That means they're going to be taking action on, and they have a four o'clock session and a six o'clock session. At four o'clock, they're going to vote on animal keeping. Uh, this is a final vote on that issue and allowing people to keep animals at their homes. And then also vote, uh, there'll be a decision on parking, and we've been kind of moving toward parking rules in the city of Flagstaff, and they'll have a final vote on that. At six o'clock, they're working on possible changes to our zoning code, and so it's open to the public, and we hope folks come out and participate, or you can watch it on streaming as well. Thank you for joining us Thank today. You. For more information, visit naztoday.com.